Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be doing 10 things I cannot live without. And I'll go ahead and get right into the video. Um, so to begin with, what do I want to start with? My phone. And I'm recording with it right now, so I can't show it. It's um, iPhone 7 Plus. It's old, but I got it this year when I upgraded because it was cheap enough and I needed a new phone so I just went ahead and got that so it last me a couple of years until I get a, a job and stuff and I can upgrade to a newer one but it's better than not having a phone I use I use it for everything I use it to film YouTube videos I use it to film TikToks to take and edit photos for Instagram Snapchat to communicate with friends, which I mean, I guess that's what everyone uses their phone for is to communicate at least. So, yeah, and then second thing, stick with the phone for a while. Um, I my headphones, I have AirPods and I have a story behind them. I can do a story time about um, something that happened with them. Um, I would just say I highly recommend AirPods. It, um, those are a few years old, and I think they're the they're the second generation without the wireless charging case. And I got them the year they came out, so not too long after they came out, actually. So yeah, they um I would highly recommend. And then I have wired ones for um when. I'm like around the house and there's louder noise and I just want to um, hear something louder or just when I, these are like dead or whatever because sometimes I forget to charge them because the charge lasts so long that I sometimes just forget to charge it and then I have to charge it for a while. Um, staying with the phone thing again. Um, Power bank. When I go on trips, which I go to Ohio almost every year, and these make really great things for trips. Not really in the car, I guess, because the, the um, car charger took me a second to remember what they're called. But when I'm like on field trips or stuff like that, they're really great. Or um, my ring light, it has a thing where you it fits in the thing for the. Um, power and when I go and get some of the outside photos I post on Instagram and stuff I just use that to power the ring lights so I can still get good lighting the um let's see one two three I can't count I can't keep numbers in my mind all right moving along from that um another thing the fourth yeah fourth thing is what I don't think anybody can not live without is, and especially nowadays, unless you're just one of those anti-maskers, which I mean, I don't want to get too political on my channel, but um, yeah, um, so a mask, um, this was white when I got it, I tie-dyed it, and I got it at the beginning of the pandemic, not too long afterwards, and I've and it's nice to have because like we need it um and i believe that they do help with safety and everything but that's just my personal opinion um and then chapstick um i love to have these like in my backpack for school and stuff because i don't my lips getting chapped i keep a couple in there and then i have like, some at my desk and stuff i just enjoy it. I got this one yesterday. It's Fanta Orange. It's it doesn't taste like the soda, but it does taste and smell good. I mean, I don't eat it, but like I lick my lips and stuff a lot, so I taste it when that. And it's your lip is right by your nose, so like you're gonna smell it. And then I also I love to smell good, and I like my breath to smell good as well. So I always have gum or like freshmen or um just anything that i can use to like 
refresh in my breath. I like pretty much all of it. I don't have any right now, but those Listerine um, breath refreshment, like it's like a little blue strip. It's in like a little capsule thing and just stick it on your tongue and it dissolves. Those are really nice. Um, another thing going with the smell good and everything. Um, deodorant, which I mean, if you don't wear deodorant, that, then I mean, you must not, you either don't need it or like you just don't mind how bad you might smell. Um, the, um, body spray, I like to have this, it's, I'm about, this thing lasts me, I use it every day, multiple times a day. And this one I like a lot more. I used to use the Old Spice Swagger Body Spray. This one's lasted me, I'd say, almost two months. And I'm already almost halfway gone with it. So it'll probably last me another two months. And I refresh a couple times a day. And I use, and I use a good amount in the morning. Or like when I change clothes, I like to make my clothes smell good. Um, another thing is body wash this is my favorite body wash it's old spice moisturize with shea butter it um it does moisturize your skin and everything and i just like the smell and i like how um it feels after you like get out of the shower and stuff it stays moisturized um which i mean it says what it's supposed to do and it works another thing that i like is this stuff, as you can see, my hair doesn't move, and it's because of these products. Um, I have some more. Um, I have like an Axe one and a L'Oreal one that I got for Christmas. Um, these are my go-tos because they, they just work real well together and everything. I got this one for Christmas. Um, it's the Got To Be Glued Styling Gel, or Styling Spiking G Glue if I can talk um and I just use it after I I take like one of those flat flat what are they called it's like a straightener but I don't know but um I use it and I curl my hair and then I let it cool down a little bit and then I run this through my hair and then to top it off I spray it with this stuff um I think with birthday money I'm gonna get the six pack because they're supposed to last like a long time and I if I and I love this stuff so much I'm gonna use it so I'll go ahead and get that it seems like it's worth the money it's like 30 bucks for a six pack this was like four bucks for one so that seems like a big price difference for me um another thing I can't live without. I mean, I could if I had to, which is the same with all this, but that's not the purpose of these videos, um, is, um, nail clippers. Now, I don't really use the clippers much because I have a bad habit of biting my nails, um, but I do use this a lot because after I bite my nails, they're kind of, like, looking all, like, awful because, like, you're not supposed to bite your nails. It's bad. Um, but I like to clean underneath my nails a lot. And when I'm bored in class, I'll just take it out of my backpack and I'll just start like filing my nails. Um, it's just something I like to do when I'm bored and stuff. And I mean, why not? And I guess that's about it for, I guess that's all the 10 things. I mean, another thing that I can't live without, I wear a hoodie every day pretty much. Even at school, I mean, it's uniform, so I wear a uniformed uh, school hoodie. But, I mean, I still love to wear hoodies. And so I guess that makes it 11 things that I can't live without. Um, so, yeah, um, I hope that 2021 is going to be a better year. And it's already started off chaotic. Um, and... Um, I'm just happy that things are hopefully going to change. It's an early enough in the year for things to change. So new beginnings, new changes, and hopefully for the better and not for the worse. Um, 
So yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, I hope everyone stays safe, and I hope everyone has a good um, year. Like and subscribe, and um, follow me for more content on TikTok, Twitter, Snapchat. Um, they're right below in the description. Um, so I will see you next week in the next video. Bye.